Epstein. I belong to the class 6603 with Dr. H. And I am here to teach a class. Hope you enjoy. Thank you. This is really just the changes, which you already know. Right? Okay, so I'm just going to work a couple of more examples of it, and then we're going to try to see. What that simply means. If you're familiar on your old typewriter, if you used to hit an L, you got an L. And if you hit the shift L, then you got an uppercase L. So what you knew is that there were other items hiding underneath the keys. Well, on your Macintosh computer, you got all kinds of letters and symbols and, and little icons hiding under the keys. So let's, let's access those. First thing that you do is go under the Apple menu and open up. The symbol called by Egyptologists a cartouche identifies a king. Together the kings ruled over 2,000 years of Egyptian history. Using temple documents such as these. to analyze both constant and accelerated motion. My friend Dennis showed us what linear constant motion looks like with his scooter.
Brittany showed us parabolic motion, and we all dropped a ball to see what linear accelerating looks like. My faith in Cole. Lisa pregunta, ¿Mi dañas un beso? Por supuesto, Papa dice, ¿Quieres? Un beso de bruja? Un beso de mariposa? Un beso de abuela? Un beso de mamá? Un beso de vacaciones? Un beso. Conozcan la tribu Su. Este grupo de nativos americanos viven en la reserva Standing Rock de Norte de Cola. Desde 1889, el Su han vivido tranquilamente en esta tierra. Entra en la cena, Dakota is you enjoy this presentation of the uses of videos in the academic environment. Now, go to the resources and watch the TED Talk video with Salman Khan and read my three written suggestions. There is a fourth one also if you want to go in depth. Then, write your comment about how do you use videos in your classes. Thank you. See you at graduation.